Hey everyone, welcome back. And in this video, I'll be showing you how to install a VPN on your router so that you'll be able to protect all devices connected to your network with just one simple setup. And I'll walk you through the steps of setting up your router, choosing a VPN provider and configuring your VPN on your router. So without further ado, let's get started. Also, if at any point, like if any of the mentioned VPNs a try, you'll find the latest discount link available in the description down below to help you save some extra money. Now for demonstration purposes, I'll be using my own router as well as ExpressVPN for this setup. So the first step is to find a secure and trusted VPN that meets all your needs, but the sea of VPNs is fast and it might take a lot of time to find the right one. So to make things easier on you, I've made a list of my top three picks and I'll be talking about them later on in this video, so stay tuned. Now to begin setting up a VPN on your router, you need to check if your router is compatible with a VPN. You can do this by going to the manual or by checking the open VPN client functionality support. And if you need a new router, consider getting one of version 2.4 or above for the best experience. Now, most VPNs support open VPN protocols on router setups, but some routers may not be capable of being configured, especially those obtained from internet service providers. With that being said, if your router is compatible, we can proceed with setting up a VPN on it. So for starters, you must log into the router's control panel and do this, enter 192.168.11 in your browser's address bar and use the default username and password, which is admin for both. Once logged in, navigate to the VPN option on the left sidebar and select VPN client, open the app profile and set up your profile and fill in your credentials in the open VPN tab. You can find your username and password by logging into your account on your VPN website and navigating to my account section. After filling in your credentials, enable auto reconnect and download an appropriate setup file for your VPN service. And to activate the VPN, upload the downloaded file to the location where you entered your service credentials and click the activate button. If everything is properly configured, you should see a blue check mark indicating a successful connection. Verify the connection status by visiting the VPN services website where it will show whether you are protected or not. And it's worth noting that the setup process may vary depending on your router and chosen VPN service. Now, with that being said, there are some drawbacks to using a router VPN. So while having a VPN router can be convenient as it allows for an unlimited devices to be connected and protected without manually connecting them to the servers. It can be inconvenient to change servers and the speed may be slower. Also, it is not possible to select different VPN servers for each device while connecting to the router. With that out of the way, let me tell you my top three picks that I recommend for this sort of setup. And so I've been regularly testing the best and most popular VPNs and have narrowed it down to Express, Nord, and Surfshark as the best three VPNs overall. Of course, they all vary in budgets and features, yet they all have a kill switch. They're excellent for torrenting, and they all consistently work with streaming services such as Netflix, Hulu, and Amazon Prime Video, and that's why these are my favorite three, but depending on your situation and preferences, one of them may be a better choice for you, and I'll explain why. Now, starting with ExpressVPN, and this is going to be the one to get if you're looking for the best overall, fastest, and easiest to use VPN, and it has the most verified no logs policy, which was demonstrated through a real life stress test proving that they don't collect or track any user data. It has over 3,000 servers in 94 countries, which is a big number of countries allowing you to easily access content from all over the globe. Plus, you can secure up to five simultaneous connections per account and it's compatible with most devices. And so ultimately, whenever people ask us what the best, most reliable VPN is, and don't mind spending a few extra dollars to ensure the highest level of reliability, Express is our trusty go-to choice for those looking for a premium VPN. Next up is NordVPN, and Nord is what I consider the best value VPN. It has over 5,400 servers in 60 countries, and while more servers does not necessarily mean better service, this can help with speed and latency, especially if you use a VPN for gaming, or if you want extra features such as a threat protection which blocks ads, malware within websites, as well as protect your device from harmful files, which is a neat little feature. And so Nord kind of gives you more options to fiddle with, and that's where the value for the money comes from, especially that it's about as fast as ExpressVPN in terms of performance, 
and will let you secure up to six devices per subscription as opposed to ExpressVPN's five device limit. So all in all, if you're someone looking to have a few more options in your VPN, then Nord would be the one to get. And then finally, Surfshark is our pick for the best budget VPN. And while it has all the essentials like Express and Nord, it's not quite as fast as those two. Although with Surfshark, you're allowed to virtually secure an unlimited number of devices with just one account, so it's a great option if you don't want any simultaneous connection limits. You also get over 3,200 servers in 100 countries, which is a lot. You still get some bonus features such as an ad blocker for blocking pop-ups, two types of specialty servers, as well as no borders mode, and rotating IP, which can be very useful if you're looking to use your VPN in a restrictive country. So ultimately, if you're looking to spend the least amount of money but still have all the core features of a premium VPN, or if you need a VPN that allows you to secure all of your devices, or if you have a large family, then Surfshark is the ideal choice. And so to sum it up, these are definitely the best in the business. Express is a premium VPN with a strong emphasis on security and utmost anonymity. And it's perfect for those who are privacy conscious and are looking for the best VPN overall. Then NordVPN is a well-rounded high-performance VPN that offers a lot of value for the money and is ideal for those looking for bonus features that can be useful in a variety of ways besides base VPN functions such as a strong encryption, secure torrenting, and working with streaming services. And Surfshark is truly the best budget VPN that gets the job done without sacrificing any of the necessary security features that you usually get with more expensive VPNs. And as an added bonus, you get to share it around with as many of your friends and family as you like, which is a great plus. So that's it for this video. Again, if you're interested in any of these VPNs, you'll find links to pricing and discounts, as well as full reviews available in the description down below. And feel free to comment below if you have any questions, as I love getting to interact with you guys. And like and subscribe if you found this video to be helpful or would like to stay up to date with our future videos. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.